Hi, I'm going to show you how to hook up an FPV system. I'm a beginner at this, so this is my first FPV system. And um, every a lot of people are suggesting to go with a very basic 5.8 gigahertz system. So that's what I've done. And I've purchased all of the things you see here from uh, online, basically. And all these things are relatively cheap. So let's start with the transmitter, which goes on your aircraft. And uh, this comes with a basic um, antenna, which it's, it is suggested to basically remove and to put on this four leaf clover antenna for better reception. Um, now you can get different elbows and shapes depending on how you're gonna mount this on your aircraft. So this uh, transmitter here is basically powered up using a 3S LiPo like this. So I'm using the balance port to do this. I'm just going to take the power from here. I could have taken the power from here too, but I just don't have the right connector. So I'm going to power this up like this. So the red light is on and uh, we need to connect this a camera. So I bought this also online. It was about $15 and it came with this power cable. So basically this power cable goes into here like this, making sure the black wire is on the corner here. So we're ready to go with this. So this is gonna be mounted on your aircraft. There you go. Now we're gonna power up this uh, screen so we can see what's going on. And basically the transmitter sends a signal to the receiver, which is a little box like this, very lightweight, it comes with the uh, power cable as well and it comes with the AV uh, cable here so again I've replaced this basic antenna with a four leaf clover for better reception and I've put some velcro in the back so I can stick it to my screen here okay and um, so this is a seven inch screen that I've also purchased not very expensive there's Many screens out there and some of them are in the hundreds of dollars. This one was $40 US, so, and it does the job. I'm gonna power this up using this small battery so that I've also Velcroed to the back. So what I'll do is I'll basically share the power. I'm gonna take the power from the battery and I've split cables here so I can power up the receiver and I can power up the screen this is coming from the screen which came with these uh, green red and black cables for power uh, neutral and ground I don't need this green one so what I did is soldered this JST connector so I can share the power like so so the screen is powered on and it's a blue screen for now what's missing is to connect the the AV ports from the receiver to the screen so I don't have a small connector I'm using basically a cable that was lying around in the house so AV to AV and there you go so basically this camera right now is transmitting to the receiver and this is what you see so there you go basic FPV system 5.8 gigahertz to begin with and uh, we'll we'll see how this goes and what the range is after further testing thanks for watching